A W R Duod, by John Hartley her ladyship's getting a babby, and they're makin' a famous to-do, they say, Providence treated her shabby, she wore fairly entitled to two. But judging by th, fuss and rejoicin', it's happen as weal as it is, for they couldn't mock more o via hoyleful, nor what they are makin' o this. He's heir to their titles and riches, far more nor he ever can spend. We, hard times and cold poverty's twitches, he'll never be called to contend. Life's ruad will be buarded wi, flars, and pleasure will wait on his train, he can suck at life's sweets, and its sars will never need cause him a pain. Ah cannot help thinking ha different it war when a wr do adi war. Born. Odd to tramp fifteen mile through a snowstorm, one bitterly, cold early morn. Odd to go axe old mally oath, hippens, if shoot act as booth doctor and nurse, and God bless her. Shu said, I, and welcome, though, ah hadn't a meg I, am I purse. To her hard scratton to get what war needed, but we managed somehow, to pull through, and what we. War short we ne'er heeded, for that child fun us plenty to do. But we'd health, and we loved one another, so a things breetened up after a while. And na, that young lad and his mother, cheer am I on wi, there prattle and smile. Them at th, hall, may mock fe easton and bluster, and their table may grew on wi, it's luod. But there's one thing on no they can't. Muster, that's a lad hoff as grand as a wr duod. For his face is like lilies and ruasses, and his limbs sich as seldom are seen, and just like his father's his noah's is, and he's gettin' his mother's blue een. So a th, lord and his lady are welcome, to mock all they like o their brat, they may hap him i, silk and i, velvet, he's net a bit. Better for that. I, life's race they'll meet all su arts o weather, but if they start fair on th, same ruod, they may run pratty nearly together, but I'll bet two to one on a wr duod.